Hi students, welcome back. I am your Siddhaya and welcome back to our SRDG PU College Math JE Coaching Classes. Today our topic is Trigonometric Ratios, Functions and Identities. Watch the first question. The equation secant square theta equal to 4xy by x plus y whole square is only possible when option a x equal to y option b x less than y option c x greater than y option d none of these watch the board the students given that secant square theta equal to 4xy by x plus y whole square is possible only when this is the question so all of you have to observe here cos square theta is always less than or equal to 1 secant square theta is greater than or equal to 1 so we have to remember this identities very well so secant square theta greater than or equal to 1 means if you follow that one 4xy by x plus y whole square greater than or equal to 1 then if you take the cross multiplication of identity 4xy is greater than or equal to x plus y whole square x plus y whole square minus 4xy less than or equal to 0. Now, this is in algebraic formula a plus b whole square minus 4ab that is called a minus b whole square x minus y whole square less than or equal to 0. So, clearly if you observe here any square is not going to be less than 0. So, it must be equal to 0 that is the only one option we have hence x minus y whole square equal to 0 and x minus y equal to 0 x equal to y so this is the answer for this question secant square theta equal to 4xy by x plus y whole square is possible only when x equal to y not only this one he can ask the question not only secant square theta cosecant square theta or sin square theta cos square theta sin square theta cos square theta is always less than or equal to 1 greater than or equal to 0 and secant square theta cosecant square theta always greater than or equal to 1 that option so we have to follow what's the next question if sin a cos a and tan a are in gp then cos cube a plus cos square a is equal to option a 1 option b 2 option c 4 option d none of these what's the board Students, given here sin a comma cos a and tan a are in GP. GP means geometric progression. All of you know if it is three terms are in GP, then b square equal to ac. That is the condition. By using this condition, we can apply cos square a equal to sin a into tan a now if you follow the term cos square a equal to sin a into sin a by cos a take the cross multiplication then it will become cos cube a equal to sin square a so cos cube a equal to sin square a but the given question is cos cube a plus cos square a equal to so, to convert into cos square a, we have to take here cos cube a equal to 1 minus cos square a, then clearly equal to 1. So, the answer is 1. What's the next question? If cos theta minus sin theta equal to root 2 sin theta, then cos theta plus sin theta equal to option a root 2 cos theta option b root 2 sin theta option c 2 cos theta option d minus root 2 cos theta what's the board see guys given cos theta minus sin theta equal to root 2 sin theta then what is cos theta plus sin theta so that is the question here one formula we can apply in trigonometry if a cos theta plus 
b sin theta equal to c and a sin theta minus b cos theta equal to d then we can write one formula by squaring and adding these two equations we will get a square plus b square equal to c square plus d square so on this formula based number of times they ask the questions in competitive exams so remember this one here a cos theta plus b sin theta equal to c and a sin theta minus b cos theta equal to d then what is the condition directly we can take a square plus b square equal to c square plus d square so from this what is d square d square equal to a square plus b square minus c square so this is the d square value then d value you can take under root a square plus b square minus c square hence if you observe here let it be d now you can follow here a equal to 1 b equal to 1 and c equal to total term root 2 sin theta hence if you take d square equal to a square plus b square 1 plus 1 minus c square that is 2 sin square theta that equal to 2 minus 2 sin square theta that equal to 2 common 1 minus sin square theta that equal to 2 cos square theta 1 minus sin square theta equal to cos square theta then d equal to root 2 cos theta so this is the value of d what he is asking cos theta plus sin theta value only he is asking that only we had taken d the d value i am finding root 2 cos theta so what we have to remember main formula here a cos theta plus b sin theta equal to c a sin theta minus b cos theta equal to d then a square plus b square equal to c square plus d square this is the main formula what's the next question if secant theta plus tan theta equal to p then tan theta is equal to option a 2p by p square minus 1 option b p square minus 1 by 2p option c p square plus 1 by 2p option d 2p by p square plus 1 what's the board see students here relation secant theta plus tan theta equal to p given then the question is what is tan theta you have the trigonometric identity secant square theta minus tan square theta equal to 1 it is in the form a square minus b square equal to 1 so a square minus b square you can write a plus b into a minus b equal to 1 then secant theta minus tan theta equal to 1 by secant theta plus tan theta so what we have to observe here you can if you know one value p then the second value is 1 by p any one value not only secant plus tan you can take secant minus tan also that means secant minus tan equal to 1 by secant plus tan so here what is secant plus tan p you can write secant theta minus tan theta equal to 1 by p then you have to find tan theta value how to find tan theta value by algebraic method only you can do you can find how many values tan theta value you can find by subtraction and secant theta value you can find by addition not only secant and tan you can find any trigonometric function by using secant and tan so here they are asking the question tan theta value by taking the subtraction here then it is secant and minus secant will get cancelled 2 tan theta equal to p minus 1 by p then tan theta equal to p square minus 1 by 2p tan theta equal to p square minus 1 by 2p so if you observe here this is the main important role in trigonometric identities this applications we can apply for cosecant square theta minus cot square theta equal to 1 also if you know cosecant plus cot 
cosecant minus cot is 1 by cosecant plus cot. Cosecant minus cot if you know, cosecant plus cot is 1 by cosecant minus cot. Like this, we can change the reciprocals. Remember this one also. What's the next question? The value of e power log of tan 1 degree base 10 plus log tan 2 degree base 10 plus log tan 3 degree base 10 plus so on plus log tan 89 degree base 10 is option A 0 option B E option C 1 by E option D none of these what's the board given question is E power log tan 1 degree base 10 plus log tan 2 degree base 10 plus log tan 3 degree base 10 so on up to log tan 89 degree base 10 so here one more small shortcut if a plus b equal to 90 degrees then tan a into tan b equal to 1 not only tan a tan b you can take cot a into cot b also 1 by using that result here logarithmic formula log a plus log b plus log c so on up to how many terms you can take that many terms you can take it as a product log of tan 1 degree into tan 2 degree into so on tan 89 degree base 10 so log a plus log b is log a b this is the basic formula you can extend this up to n terms also now here e power log of if you take the pairs which a plus b equal to 90 degrees that is tan 1 degree and tan 89 degree this is one pair then tan 1 in 1 plus 89 is 90 degrees hence tan 1 into tan 89 is 1 like that one more pair tan 2 into tan 88 degree before 89 like this if you continue you will get one more pair tan 44 degree into tan 46 degree this is one more pair remaining is tan 45 degrees that one term only it will remain so if you follow the formula it will become 1 and it will become 1 it will become 1 every term is 1 and this is also tan 45 value is also 1 hence e power log 1 base 10 so e power log 1 log 1 value is 0 so e power 0 equal to 1 if you take log 1 value 0 it will become 1 e power 0 equal to 1 this is the answer there are options d option we can take none of these so here multi conceptual question logarithmic formula and trigonometric identities that also we applied here what's the next question the value of 2 into sin power 6 theta plus cos power 6 theta minus 3 into sin power 4 theta plus cos power 4 theta plus 1 is option a 2 option b 0 option c 4 option d 6 watch the board see this question here sin power 6 theta plus cos power 6 theta sin power 4 theta plus cos power 4 theta these are the standard trigonometric functions these two trigonometric functions we can take the direct formulas because we can we have to remember this one two times in j means he asked the same functional questions here sin power 4 you can write sin square whole square cos square whole square a square plus b square formulas we can apply then we will get the value 1 minus 2 sin square theta cos square theta and sin power 6 plus cos power 6 a square whole cube plus b square whole cube that is sin square whole cube plus cos square 
whole cube. A cube plus B cube formula we will apply and we have to do then we will get 1 minus 3 sin square theta and cos square theta. So remember these two directly that is sin power 4 plus cos power 4 equal to 1 minus 2 sin square theta cos square theta and sin power 6 plus cos power 6 theta equal to 1 minus 3 sin square theta cos square theta. Now if you take the corresponding multiples 2 and 3 plus 1 that equal to so 2 into 1 2 minus 6 sin square theta cos square theta minus 3 plus 6 sin square theta into cos square theta plus 1 then minus 6 sin square theta cos square theta plus 6 sin square theta cos square theta will get cancelled 2 plus 1 3 3 minus 3 0 so the answer is 0 this we can do in verification method also in the options not only options in question if you take theta equal to some angle substitution sin cos you can verify with theta equal to 0 or 90 tan cot we can't verify with 0 or 90 it's better to go with 45 degrees so here sin cos only you can verify with theta equal to 0 degrees what is sin 0 0 cos 0 1 then 2 into 1 2 sin 0 0 cos 0 1 minus 3 into 1 minus 3 plus 1 then you will get 2 minus 3 plus 1 3 minus 3 that is 0 so in this way also verification method we can apply for this question what's the next question if x belongs to r mod cos x greater than or equal to sin x this is one set intersection 0 to 3 pi by 2 equal to option a closure interval 0 to pi by 4 union closure interval 3 pi by 4 to 3 pi by 2 option b closure interval 0 to pi by 4 union closure interval pi by 2 to 3 pi by 2 option c closure interval 0 to pi by 4 union closure interval 5 pi by 4 to 3 pi by 2 option d closure interval 0 to 3 pi by 2 watch the board the students here two sets he had given what is the two sets first set is x belongs to r and mod cos x greater than or equal to sin x and second set is 0 to 3 pi by 2 what is the common range of these two sets that we have to find here we have to follow the graph of sin x and cos x if you take the sin x graph from 0 to 2 pi 0 to pi and pi to 2 pi so 0 to pi and pi to 2 pi this is the value related to minus 1 and this is the value related to 1 so this is pi by 2 and this is 3 pi by 2 sin 90 value 1 sin 270 value minus 1 next what is the next graph mod cos x not cos x here mod cos x mod cos x is always positive not negative so cos 0 1 it will start from here cos 90 0 so it is the graph will decrease like this next 92 180 so the graph will increase like this and 180 to 270 the graph will downfall like this so here we need till 270 only hence we can consider this graph here where the graph is increasing first we have to find the intersection points this is 45 degrees and this is after 90 and before 180 that is 135 degrees 3 pi by 4 if you observe here cos x is greater than sin x mod cos x is greater than sin x where is this part it is mod cos x this is the cos x graph this is sin x graph cos x is greater than between 0 to pi by 4 and here if you observe here this is cos x and this is sin x so this part also cos x is greater than sin x 
but this part clearly sin x is greater than cos x hence which part we can take here 0 to pi by 4 closed interval union 3 pi by 4 2 3 pi by 2 so this is the common range where mod cos x greater than or equal to sin x from 0 to 3 pi by 2 so it plays very very important role sin x cos x graphs and mod sin x mod cos x graphs and one more graph so sin square x and cos square x graphs also this should be perfect then only we can identify immediately what is the graphical problem what's the next question if y equal to 1 plus tan a into 1 minus tan b where a minus b equal to pi by 4 then y plus 1 whole power y plus 1 is equal to option a 9 option b 4 option c 27 option d 81 what's the board see guys here y equal to 1 plus tan a into 1 minus tan b and a minus b equal to pi by 4 then y plus 1 whole power y plus 1 that is the question so a minus b equal to pi by 4 and the question is in terms of tan so clearly you have to apply tan on both sides to the given expression then if you apply tan tan of a minus b equal to tan 45 that is 1 tan of a minus b formula tan a minus tan b by 1 plus tan a into tan b that equal to 1 by taking the cross multiplication tan a minus tan b equal to 1 plus tan a into tan b now keep it one here only write the remaining terms this side then it will become tan a minus tan b minus tan a tan b equal to 1 now add 1 on both sides 1 plus tan a minus tan b minus tan a tan b equal to 2 by adding 1 on both sides 1 plus 1 it will become 2 clearly this is 1 plus tan a and by taking tan b common minus tan b common you will get 1 plus tan a hence you can write it is 1 plus tan a into 1 minus tan b equal to 2 now you got the given question 1 plus tan a into 1 minus tan b value equal to 2 so this only he can ask in one more way that is a plus b equal to 45 then you will get here tan a plus tan b plus tan a tan b equal to 1 tan a plus tan b plus tan a tan b equal to 1 that also there is a possibility not only 45 they can give the question with the 225 degrees also but the same answer you will get uh, so now y value equal to 2 if y value equal to 2 2 plus 1 3 2 plus 1 3 3 power 3 so that equal to 27 the answer is 27 remember the same question they can ask a minus b equal to 45 or 225 a plus b equal to 45 or 225 then the answer is 2 only so what is the final answer 27 what's the next question if cos of alpha plus beta equal to 4 by 5 and sin of alpha minus beta equal to 5 by 13 and alpha comma beta lie between 0 and pi by 4 then tan 2 alpha equal to option a 16 by 63 option b 56 by 33 option c 28 by 33 option d none of these what's the board 
cos of alpha plus beta equal to 4 by 5 sin of alpha minus beta equal to 5 by 13 then question is tan 2 alpha here what is eliminated angle is beta so you can write 2 alpha in terms of alpha plus beta and alpha minus beta here tan of alpha plus beta plus alpha minus beta tan of alpha plus beta plus alpha minus beta so this value is 2 alpha clearly it is in the form tan a plus b tan a plus b formula you know tan a plus tan b by 1 minus tan a tan b so here how to find tan of alpha plus beta value by taking simply right angle triangle here cos of alpha plus beta given by taking the right angle triangle 4 by 5 that is adjacent side by hypotenuse so all of you know then the value of this one is 3 hence tan of alpha plus beta equal to opposite side by adjacent side that is 3 by 4 from this you have to take one more right angle triangle with the angle alpha minus beta here 90 degrees and sin of alpha minus beta means opposite side by hypotenuse then automatically this will become 12 12 square plus 5 square is 13 square then tan of alpha minus beta equal to 5 by 12 now clearly you got the values tan of alpha plus beta and tan of alpha minus beta sub uh, apply here that is tan of alpha plus beta plus tan of alpha minus beta 3 by 4 plus 5 by 12 by 1 minus 3 by 4 into 5 by 12 so if you solve this one lcm is 48 12 threes 36 4 fives 20 36 plus 20 56 by 48 and 1 minus 15 by 48 48 minus 15 that is 33 by 48 clearly you are getting the answer 56 by 33 here regular questions is there but here different question he can ask the question tan 2 alpha or tan 2 beta also 2 alpha means plus we will take 2 beta means minus we will consider so finally the given for the given question the answer is 56 by 33 what's the next question tan 100 degrees plus tan 125 degrees plus tan 100 into tan 125 degrees equal to option a 0 option b 1 by 2 option c minus 1 option d 1 what's the board students here just now we discussed this one formula direct formula if a plus b equal to 45 degrees are 225 degrees any one of these two then 1 plus tan a into 1 plus tan b equal to 2 you can write or tan a plus tan b plus tan a into tan b equal to 1 by adding 1 on both sides you will get 2 hence tan a plus tan b plus tan a tan b equal to 1 the final answer is 1 when we have to apply this one if a plus b equal to 100 plus 125 how much it is 225 hence 1 plus tan a into 1 plus tan b he can give like this 1 plus tan 100 into 1 plus tan 125 225 he can divide like anything so that's why a plus b should be 45 or 225 that is equal to 2 or tan a plus tan b plus tan a tan b equal to 1 what's the next question cos 12 degrees minus sin 12 degrees by cos 12 degrees plus sin 12 degrees plus sin 147 degrees by cos 147 degrees equal to 
ऑप्शन ए वन ऑप्शन बी माइनस वन ऑप्शन सी जीरो ऑप्शन डी नन ऑफ दिस वॉच द बोर्ड स्टूडेंट्स हियर कॉस ट्वेल्व माइनस साइन ट्वेल्व बाय कॉस ट्वेल्व प्लस साइन ट्वेल्व प्लस साइन वन फोर्टी सेवन बाय कॉस वन फोर्टी सेवन इक्वल टू दैट इज द गिवन क्वेश्चन हेंस इफ यू टेक हियर वन फॉर्मूला वी हैव टेन ऑफ फोर्टी फाइव प्लस ए इक्वल टू यू कैन राइट इट इज वन प्लस टेन ए बाय वन माइनस टेन ए बाय अप्लाइंग द टेन ए प्लस बी फॉर्मूला ओनली like that if it is minus we will get here 1 minus tan a by 1 plus tan a hence if you convert sin a by cos a then it will become cos a plus r minus sin a by cos a minus r plus sin a now if numerator is plus denominator is minus answer is tan 45 plus a if numerator is minus Answer is tan 45 minus a. Numerator sign is important, but cos plus sign by cos minus sign or cos minus sign by cos plus sign. So if you observe here, cos 12 minus sin 12 that equal to tan 45. Numerator sign is minus, hence we can take minus 45 minus a. 45 minus 12 plus sin 147. We can write it as 180 minus 33. That is sine thirty three. Cos one forty seven. You can write it as cos one eighty minus thirty three. That is equal to minus cos thirty three. Hence tan forty five minus twelve. Tan thirty three degrees minus tan thirty three degrees. Sine by cos tan. That equal to zero. Mainly we have to remember the formula. Cos plus sine by cos minus sine. If it is plus, tan 45 plus a. Cos minus sine by cos plus sine. If it is minus, it is tan 45 minus a. By observing that formula only, immediately you can observe. This is cos minus sine by cos plus sine. Minus will become 45 minus a. That only we are following. What's the next question? Tan 20 degrees into tan 40 degrees into tan 60 degrees into tan 80 degrees equal to option a 1 option b 2 option c 3 option d root 3 by 2 what's the board students here tan 20 degrees into tan 40 degrees into tan 60 degrees into tan 80 degrees that is the question here three formulas we have to remember sin theta into sin 60 minus theta into sin 60 plus theta equal to 1 by 4 sin 3 theta and cos theta into cos 60 minus theta into cos 60 plus theta equal to 1 by 4 cos 3 theta if you divide both these formulas we will get tan theta into tan 60 minus theta into tan 60 plus theta equal to sin 3 theta by cos 3 theta that is tan 3 theta hence where what is the small angle here 20 degrees that we have to consider as theta hence if you take this is theta it is 60 minus theta it is 60 plus theta hence tan theta into tan 60 minus theta into tan 60 plus theta is tan 3 theta you can take it is these three terms so tan 3 into 20 degrees into what is the remaining angle here tan 60 degrees so that equal to root 3 into root 3 that equal to 3 so these three formulas very very important Sin theta into sin 60 minus theta into sin 60 plus theta equal to 1 by 4 sin 3 theta. Cos theta into cos 60 minus theta into cos 60 plus theta equal to 1 by 4 cos 3 theta. Tan theta into tan 60 minus theta into tan 60 plus theta equal to tan 3 theta. What's the next question? Cos 2 pi by 15 into 
cos 4 pi by 15 into cos 8 pi by 15 into cos 16 pi by 15 equal to option A 1 by 2, option B 1 by 4, option C 1 by 8, option D 1 by 16. What's the board? See guys, here this is related to one formula cos theta into cos 2 theta into cos 2 square theta into cos 2 cube theta into so on cos 2 power n minus 1 theta. The terms till 2 power n minus 1 means it is 2 power 0, 2 power 1, 2 power 2, 2 power n minus 1. Total n terms product then it will become sin 2 power n theta by 2 power n into sin theta sin 2 power n theta by 2 power n into sin theta hence here what is theta place we have 2 pi by 15 2 into 2 pi 4 pi 2 square means 2 into 2 square that is 2 cube 8 pi again 2 power 4 16 pi it is doubled every angle is doubled clearly how many terms we have four terms in place of n we have to apply four hence the answer will become sin 2 power 4 16 16 into 2 pi by 15 theta 16 2 pi by 15 by 2 power 4 16 into sin theta 2 pi by 15 so here 16 into 2 32 32 pi by 15 how to write that one we can write it is sin 32 pi by 15 means 2 pi plus 2 pi by 15 clearly it is 15 to 30 30 plus 2 32 pi by 15 by 16 into sin 2 pi by 15 hence sin 2 pi plus theta is sin theta only it is sin 2 pi by 15 and it is sin 2 pi by 15 after cancellation of these two we will get the answer 1 by 16 the main formula is cos theta into cos 2 theta into cos 2 square theta into cos 2 cube theta into so on cos 2 power n minus 1 theta equal to sin 2 power n theta by 2 power n sin theta hence the answer is 1 by 16 dear students in regular manner, we are going to ask one question on trigonometric ratios, functions and identities. What's the monitor? If cos alpha plus 2 cos beta plus 3 cos gamma equal to 0, sin alpha plus 2 sin beta plus 3 sin gamma equal to 0 and alpha plus beta plus gamma equal to pi then the value of sin 3 alpha plus 8 sin 3 beta plus 27 sin 3 gamma equal to option a 0 option b 3 option c 1 option d minus 1 send your answers via sms in the following format Type S R D G I F N M A T I F N zero nine and your option A R B R C R D and send it to triple eight double four eight six nine one five. First three SMS senders with right option will get a gift. Students, I will come back with a new topic in the next episode. Until then. Bye bye.
Vidya Daini Residential School, KR Nagar, Harihar. Admissions open from nursery to 10th CBSC syllabus. Shrivati Radha Bai D. Gopal Rao PU College. Admissions open for PUC Science and Commerce. And Vidya Daini Degree College. Admissions open for BCom and BA. Contact today 944811518.